I toast. You got first. me don't would you do me a favor please go take your meds drink some water read a book just invest a little time on yourself today you deserve it hey that's so much hi carter oh fuck it's saturday i I forgot what day of the week it was. Hi, Mac. Uh... Wait, why does Dell and the soundbite not sound like Dell? I don't know. Carter, I forgot it was Saturday. Is that not what I sound like to you guys? I'm confused now. Because I recorded with the same stuff. It's really confusing, I guess. Which does something in? Because I literally just recorded it with my streaming setup and then stripped off the video. Or maybe it was compressing somehow. I don't like it. I don't like the way it sounds. I need someone to edit it to to make it sound like the real me. Um. Well, I don't like the way I sound either. So, um, I I totally forgot that it was Saturday, and I I'm set up for Vintage Story. Wait. I'm sorry, Carter. Um, it doesn't sound like Discord me either. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know how to fix that. Can someone make that clip sound like me? I'm sorry. Next week, trucks? Okay. You're on. Bet. As Pud would say, bet. <laughs> this tear in my nail is not fixing up. Um, I'm really disturbed that I don't sound like me. true those Danubes and their you thing all over the place in front of salads and stuff um no the ads are almost finished um yeah man I'm really thrown off now I totally I lost a day this week I completely lost a day. I totally thought it was Friday. Uh, uh, it's fine. Okay. Um, so I may 
I made some almond butter. Wow, it looks really delicious. I made some almond butter. I saw that. Um, almond butter. And it's... It was really easy to make. And it's fucking delicious on graham crackers. Um... And I, f I feel like maybe that's a healthy-ish snack. Perhaps. Like, there's... It's like a, a cup worth of almond butter. There's like a tablespoon of honey and like half a teaspoon of salt in there. And the rest is just almonds. Oh, and a little bit of coconut oil. So like in terms of snacks go, I think that's pretty good, right? <sighs> Better than candy. Yeah, I saw them join um join Drax's Kofi. Um So I was learning, lurking. Okay. Okay. Okay, Carter. I will. I will try not to stress about it. <laughs> Hi, Stu. There's a rift in my pomegranate tree. <sighs> who, who did that? Okay, so last night I found a um a translocator near my place. Near near ish my place. And I thought these were the metal scraps I need, but they're not the two fix it. Um, but I don't think that is what I need. You know what, before we do anything else, let's see if I can make an all glass charcoal. Let's do pop some trees down. lot of trees
Let's see what I can do with that. Clear. Oh, it took out some of the neighboring tree. Righto. Hi, Prickly. It's okay. How you doing? One, two, five, six, seven. Hi, Ravi. Thank you. Yeah, you've done a lot of mending lately, Berkeley. Well, that one didn't give me a seat. Well, it's good practice. No, but at least... Um... We're saving money. And that's that's pretty enjoyable. Well, let's start off trying it. Like, I don't need these, but let's start off like this. And I don't think, I think I'm going to still need to let here. Jesus Christ, this is a lot, this song. All right, it's almost finished. It's <laughs> a wine. Yeah, it is lit. It is officially lit. Oh. 
Sounds like you're doing good, though. The, the only hazard I could think of, though, with this is that glass is so easy to break. Oh, gosh. Gonna lurk her bit. Okay, look. <laughs> what is this playlist doing today? S Swan Lake. My coffee tastes weird today. Oh my god, Luke. That's so terrible. I love it. That is that is really good. Yeah, I was just like reading it and I was like, oh, <sighs> it's so it was very good. I feel pretty smart. Mm. Um, all right. Uh, I am so fucking scared of brain. That's a good point, Doris. This playlist is bizarre. I picked cinematic, mysterious, and cinematic. I'm not sure how Swan Lake is cinematic. I mean, 
mysterious. I could have sworn I used to put candy into the uh, sun, like candied fruit into the uh, sunflower candy. Yes, Drax. Oh, wait, I don't know if you're in chat. We need these guys to fuck off. So... Um, I need to... Today I want to try and see if I can figure out how to fix a translocator, which means I think I have to go into... Uh, into a cave um and i want to get the road built out to my place so i need to do a northern run because Stu has a bunch of rocks you know what let's write a sign Today's sign will be uh, Oh, I put all the charcoal away. That's real helpful. Why? Why did I put all the charcoal outside? Wait, did I? I don't think I've got anything else in here that I can use to write with, have I? I keep seeing this blueprint as something else. Oh, I definitely don't have any. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh, hey, I've got two temporal gears. Oh, but they don't stack. Okay, so. All I need is the the scrap, right? It's midnight. Mm. <laughs> Hi, Kimberly. Thank you for the like. Hi, Sadie. 
I got very confused then. That, that terrible joke, Sadie, was courtesy of Luke. And my first thought was that I had to share it with you because... Because it was perfect. Okay, it's calm for 14 minutes. Why can't they fuck off? Um, your new co-worker plays Minecraft and Parlia and D. Oh shit. That's amazing, but also dangerous. I'm just putting my cardio on because I'm oh no except my cardi is cold Um, so is, are they a full-timer? Uh, or is it part-time? Oh, I want charcoal. So clearly very cool. All right, so. Plus. Apple pits, northern trip, berries, rocks. What else did I need from up the north? Oh, do it. I genuinely have no idea what this playlist is doing. Let's <sighs> pick shovel. Don't need the size.
This is very bond. Okay. It covers a really large area. Alright, well I guess I'll go play some... Vlog. I don't want to explore caves. Caves are scary. But I'm also really curious what's through the translocator. Oh, it goes up there. Hey, thank you for the raid. I don't I don't know what's going on right now. I have no idea what's going on right now. Um, but hi, hello, welcome, thank you for the raid. I hope you had a good stream. Um, welcome in. My, my brain isn't functioning particularly well today. But yes, we, we're good. We're doing good. Um, 
Um, how was yours? Oh, you're playing Sims Medieval. It's cool. I haven't played that in a very, very, very long time. if I can just make those stairs that's fun the um my favorite sims 3 dlc was I think it was called dragon valley which was very much like the medieval I think it was Dragon Valley, something like that. It was very Celtic y medieval. Um, but yeah, welcome in, everyone. Uh, hello, I am Del Deliria. Uh, my pronouns are she, her, uh, and I am currently playing Winter Story, uh, which I I play a lot of. I, I play I, I dabble in other games, but um, I'm really enjoying this one. right now I am building a road to a new construction site. Which is uh, a process. I think what I need to do here Just move everything over when. Can do this. It's a weird little wiggle on the road. Don't need it to do that. This is one of those projects that if, if, I think if you're of a, a particular type of, of mindset, you find it very rewarding. Otherwise you'll be like, but why are you doing this? Oh hey, that lined up perfectly. Using the um, the hay blocks as like placeholders is pretty handy. What 
is this playlist? Is this mysterious? Give that one of there. Though honestly, it's not a bad tune. Hey, Molly oh God. asked me, "Hey, David, who is the bee's knees?" <laughs> In the vivid tapestry of the natural world, the phrase oh. "the bee's knees" might refer to a creature of particular excellence. In this digital realm, Deliria, weaving their oh. way through the intricate landscapes oh. of vintage story, oh. could indeed be the bee's knees of this virtual ecosystem. They navigate through the myriad of challenges with the grace of a gazelle on the savanna. <laughs> the grace of a gazelle. <laughs> As I choke on my own slobber. Fuck me. Thank you, Molly. That was really sweet. <laughs> Grace of Gazelle. That's me. Uh, oh. Thank you for the Tangier and the, the kind words. That was very good. Did you. <laughs> Well, I think you're pretty fucking fantastic too. So there. <laughs> he is pretty smart. Uh, Flint and I enjoyed watching um, his his dinosaurs. I did, I did, but I don't. Th think I'm going to be one of the lucky ones. Which I'm a bit confused about. But yes. I did. I did. I got the email and I'm like, I should I should join. I should join. I'm using I'm using Hayblocks here to mark the path. Oh, no. Oh, oh no, the server. No, server. That has actually turned out to pay. Um, turned out to be pretty handy. The color thing. Hello. Hi, Echo. Yeah, I I can't claim credit for it. It was something that I found off. Um, on threads actually and I asked them I'm like hey I really like this idea can I can I use it please and they said yeah we got it from someone else so you know go for it um what I really want to try and figure out is if there's a way that I can use streamer bot to just like I don't know, maybe I just need to push a, a button. Am I not turtly enough for the turtle club? Right? But like some way of just like putting like a little color heart like up by my bee. <clears throat> um, but yeah, the original, the, the reasoning behind it um, is last, last week it was, it was rough. 
Yeah, that's what I was saying. I was like trying to figure if there's a way that I can just like extract the emoji from my title and just put it up there automatically or something. Um, but yeah, I was really struggling last week and, and Echo being the absolutely wonderful person they were, they wanted, they didn't want to ask me how I was because you know sometimes if you ask someone how they are and they're already feeling rough, it can make it worse. So I was like, how can I telegraph where I am without... Like, I don't want to farm attention, but I think, like, it's a useful tool. So I don't, I don't know. I mean, I could literally just make a button on my stream deck. Or, like, each button for a color and just, like, do it that way. Yeah. This playlist is so fucking weird. Well, it is, um, as Ali said as well, it'll help the mods do the modding. Well, thank you, Sadie. I mean, I, ca I can't claim credit for it. And, uh, but I'll, I'll definitely try and the heck out of it it did it absolutely did echo 100% I like that something useful came out of it this is where I'm gonna build also I found I have a telescope now this is where I'm gonna build my new house Right, right there. The zoom in is very, very cool. Okay, so it's not, it's not actually a telescope. Um, what it is, is a mod that lets you just zoom in. All it does is like narrow your field of view using in the slider and then like it's a really simple thing but it's actually really useful and I forgot that I installed it um isn't it great I can't uh Well, I think it was just like zoom or something. Zoom button, I think it was called. Yeah. Um, so yeah, this is where I'm going to build my... Oh, hey, there's a pineapple. Build my new base. This, this playlist is a trip, man. Um, so I, I need to do, whoopsie. Maybe I should straighten that bit out. If I'm poor, that's like the second time I've fallen in there. Your groceries arrived, nice. Because I really don't want to cut the tree down. That sounds really good. Smoked salmon chips and hummus. I put I put dinner in the for the slow cooker for the later, but I haven't had any lunch wires yet today.
But I I do have graham crackers and almond butter. Um, homemade almond butter, and I'm feeling pretty fucking fancy that I made that. Quietly. Well, not quietly actually, because I just tooted my own horn about it. Why? We've had Swan Lake and now we've got the Sugar Plum Fairy. Holy shit, that works. So I have the, um, the skill that lets you, that increases your step height and now I can walk up two blocks. So this is the the path. <clears throat> um that it'll take to get me to my other house. Don't I don't really need it. But it might be helpful. But I need to go north. I need to pick up a load of stones. From Stu's place. <laughs> and I need to collect some berries from the north. I miss berries. And I need to get some high good high 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 good dirt. I can't word. Need some good dirt, man. Good dirt. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, Toast, I would probably also make my presence felt if you opened up salmon and chips around me. Just saying. The mango tree. Oh, oh, I need to check the charcoal. This is why I hadn't gone north yet. Oh, it, look. Mm. I mean, that works. Wait, what? I, oh. Drex has crabs dropping on his head. Yeah, we were curious if you could make a charcoal pit out of glass. And, uh... Yes. Well, it's just, like, being able to see when it's done. Is, is pretty handy. And now I just have this like random stack of charcoal sitting here. Which I, I kind of like.
All right. So I think I need to make some more food. Um, I've I've added another one. This was my one for today. But I've already done one of those things. No, no, stew, stew off it. Um, but yeah, I'm going to make another batch of... Candy. I said I want to get some good dirt too. And I found a translocator in a ruin by my place that was above ground. So I need some metal scrap. I have the two blue wheelie things. You're gonna be of course awesome of course you are I think, I think that will do. Um. Wait, no, I'm gonna need more because if I go through the, you need two metal scrap and two temporal gears to fix a translocator, right? But then if you go through it, don't you need to fix the one that you that's at the other end? Oh, it's three temporal gears. The other one? Okay. <sighs> Look, Echo answering my vintage story questions. Pick that out. That's so cool. Alright, I'm... Ignore. So you, when you repair one, you're repairing pair. And now I've said pair so many times it doesn't make sense. <clears> hmm. <throat>
Just win. Drag says just win. One fixes the other. Okay. The master, right? That's that's pretty much how I feel. Oh. Well, that ain't a crater hole. Okay, I have ads popping in 30 seconds, but I am not in a good place to stop. But I do... Metal parts, not metal scrap. Um, I do need to get grab a snack. So I think I'm just gonna log out, log out, so I can find a a norm. Um, and then I will be right back in a few minutes. Uh, industry. All right, be right back.
Hi, Luna. All right, to go. Grab some bread and butter and have a wee. <sighs> Just a little bit chilly here. Spawn on my head. That's uncool. Oh dear. Like right on my head. Oh my god, being able to climb up two blocks at once is so fucking good. Oh, ow. Oh, that tickled. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Why am I even here? Look suspiciously like. Oh, it might. Carry on. I'm not following my own map markers. This is the problem. Any of your coffee? Oh, there we go. I got my coffee. I think this is probably going to be a two coffee cup day. By coffee cup, I mean the giant mug that I use. Well, it's not really giant. Have I gone off track again? I have, but also what's that? You know what's a really great idea? Exploring at night when you can't see shit. Oh, hello. Oh, I. I think I've already dug in there.
gonna leave that for me to fall into. It'll be fine. <laughs> okay, so I need metal parts, not metal scrap. That was what Stu was saying before I logged out. I was like, ooh, copper. Oh, you've got some of your old place? I know I I know I only need two. I mean I could just you know be brave or something. I've got so many caves and in, in this plateau, there's gotta be something there. I'm heading up your way. I've got two that I found in ruins. I found three all together in ruins. Um, the first one I got, Stu gave me. So that I could bind to my treehouse. Oh no, I haven't seen one of those before. I've seen the skeletons. Ooh, good job. <coughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, once again, people are like, why is Toast talking to themselves? Oh, charcoal's not hot enough for phosphorus? What do you have to use then? Oh. Oh, that's annoying. Like ten oh, black coal, right. I'm definitely not there yet. Bye. 
Fuck me. <clears throat> Jerks. I think I'm no, not quite. It's like I think I'm to the sea. Oh, I forgot how far this was. I really need to make a bunch of torches and shit and actually mark off this path. Okay. Bread and butter. Done. Oh no, I see a, a, I see a clip in the clips channel. Oh god. Oh, I'm still going north. I don't think there's any point checking this tree, but I will. Like, what did I do? Thanks. I appreciate you all doing the clips. It is a big goddamn mood. Thanks. I tried. <laughs> I wish we could have arrows at 45 degrees as well. I'm I'm basically following my my map markers here. Oh, apparently I'm going to toast house. <laughs> Hi, hello. I don't I don't know, Drax. It good. Hi. Mo even Molly's been in here. Hello. I mean. There's so much saturation with alerts in everything that I don't catch half of. Why am I going to toasts? 
Apparently, I'm gonna go see Toast. No, purple stew is or uh, toast is orange. Purple leads to my old place. But I guess technically stew that would also lead to stew. We're on a long a bit. But but hi Drax. Welcome to chat. Yeah, it leads to your old road. Fancy seeing you here. The, the bread and butter didn't do it for me. I'm still naked. Fun fact! That would be really annoying. That would bother me immensely. That is interesting. Thanks, Maria. I like things like that. Wouldn't it be terrible if he dropped it on his foot? I guess it depends on how big it was. Oh good, the sun's coming up. But yeah, the the or the orange seaway is to House of Toast. It would. He was also hard of hearing. Huh? Well, that would help then, wouldn't it? I guess. It was heavy enough, you'd feel the vibration on the floor, perhaps. I, I literally just went into automatic mode and decided I was going to toast place when I was supposed to be going to stews. Hi, Karen. Hello. <coughs> I see, um, I, I see Pierre has found his way to a new home. Hey! So good. I might as well be nosy and look at everyone's houses, I guess. Wolf and friend and bees. Whoa, this is a big thing. <gasps> Look at your fruit trees. Oh, you got a fancy crown. Don't mind me, just be nosy. Right? Oh, it's like, don't mind me, I just have a meteoric health hammer. Third age. Last I saw you were in the fish. Oh, look at those berry bushes. I'm 
Whoa. Oh my god, that's that is popping. That green. Is the speed boosted on this too? Or am I sliding? Crab age. There you go. I love that green. How do you put the tiles down? Right? It's just, it's, it is bold. Your, your water bucket has been painted. Porcelain tiles with water. Got it. Toast, you fancy. Look at this. <laughs> Don't mind me. I just like barge on in. Open all the, wow. Open all the doors. Purple wood wine racks. Drax, you need to step up your game. Look at this. Come on now. <laughs> I kind of like the idea that Jarman just thinks you're all crazy and talking to like... I don't know. No one. Having a conversation with no one. This is super cool. Oh, is that the distillery? Okay. That's cool. This is awesome. Right? Oh, the tea set. Oh, it's so cute. But you just, oh, you gave me a teapot and some teacups, <laughs> right? <laughs> One lump or two. I would, I do quite like having some tea and toast. So dignified. Look at us. <laughs> yes, I love it when Toast vomits things at me as well. Okay, while I'm here, I'm gonna have a little, just a, a little bit of, oh god, almond butter on a graham cracker. I saw that. Ooh. Yum. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's from the bricklayers mod. This almond butter is like frosting. Right in. Oh. I'm having second thoughts about this playlist again. I'm not even sure when tracks are. Lizards come in mysterious and then they drop the base. What? Mm -hmm. Yeah, tea time with toast. All right, I messed away. My hat looks like I have pizza on my head. 
Are you heading up too? All right. Uh, where am I going? North. To the water. Oh, you have done some work around here. I think I'm going to make some almond butter and take it over to the neighbors. I can't take them some of the bitch that I made this time because I put my fingers in it. Because I was just tasting it as I went. Um, but the next batch around. I think I might take some to the neighbors. Post is still so much faster than me, it's hilarious. You don't need to wait for me if you don't want to, Toast. I said I'm heading up to Stew's, I guess, first, and then back to my flat. Well, yes, yeah, up to Stew's. Well, I guess I've got to go to my old place first. <clears throat> um, I want to harvest some berries while I'm up there. Oh, right, your old place with the, yeah. This Big trip to the north. But yeah, I've got to head up to <coughs> my old place um, and harvest some berries. And um, stews to get some rocks. Brown coal to make. Oh, I actually have a brown coal pit right near my place. <clears throat> and I have like such a fro in my throat again. Yeah, purple arrows are the great the great northern route. <coughs> um I haven't I haven't marked them all, but I know there's a few by my players. There's one ages away. And, and then I found one, like, basically outside my back door. Because I didn't mark it. So I was like, I don't need to mark coal. Whatever. Well, I was wrong. But yeah, I might do a little bit of a, a northern <clears throat> a northern romp. See what I can find. Oh, 
All right, now we are on the toasty road. That's the thing I miss, see, when you're... <clears throat> when you're navigating by raft, you don't need to hold down the button. Just run. Ooh, that fruit bar did a good fill up. Malachite. Ooh, maybe. The only, the only thing that's put me off trying to mess with dyes is having to... Uh, Toast says yes. Uh, is having to mess with mordant. O says malachite is the best color. of a road like this little one that I'm trying to build and I'm like oh my god this is <clears throat> tedious <laughs> building my little small one I'm like no everyone else is just building these fucking highways Oh, I mean, like, this Stu's place, I'm sure, is a, a complete sprawl now. Like, every time I, I look at it, it's, like, just huge. Most roaming empire, 100% yes. Stu's place is a village. I'm sure. She's like got even some sort of like automation processes going. Whee! This is old house of toast. Actually, that reminds me, I need to. Uh... <coughs> oh! Thank you! Sweet! Oh, thank you very much! Then we can find out where New Excite is gonna be. I already have two Temporal Gears, so they should do it, right? Now I don't have bees right next to my door I, I find the sound of them charming again right thank you toast all right now hopefully i don't die and lose stuff in the process wait All right. Your old places donated community property. Yeah, that's what I figure. Like my mind is just sort of there. I'll replant when I get there. So, you know, consider it a safe house, I guess. All 
Oh god, it's so different up here. It would be great if if uh i could find if that one went up to the north because i have a deer or <laughs> yay <laughs> i'm so glad um i have a deer that i made for deer drop for this where it of taking doing a tiktok of the uh, aurora borealis so i figured that would be a really neat way to showcase this game so it'd be really cool if that one went north i mean i can't enter <clears throat> i can't enter the deer as for like to go into win the gift cards that would be cheaty but i could still do it I, I've I think twice now I've poked at Vintage Story about Deirdrop. I feel like it'd be a really useful site for them to to try and leverage to get some more, you know, some more players. But I also don't want to be a, a, an annoying nag. Oh 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 oh. I forgot that there's a meteor here. I marked it. I marked it. I marked it. Right there. It's a sewer fight. Oh, look at all that dirt. Is that Pete? It's Pete. Mmm. Delicious, delicious Pete. Oh yeah, look at that. I forgot about colors and seasons. That's the thing about being so far south. There is no season. Well, there's one season. Hot. <laughs> oh yeah, it's 10 degrees Celsius here. I'm like mentally compiling a list of things i want to take back with me like i want berries but i don't think i'm gonna be able to get any and like flowers and i want to replant the garden at my old house just so that it's Potentially a place to find food. Check in and make sure that panda hasn't done any, caused any havoc. Oh, hi, Tom. Oh, I've got a, an amazing spot that I'm building in. No building. Will build. Wrong tense. This is, this is my old place. But yeah, peat and dirt. I wish peat would stack in higher than amounts than 32. <clears throat> I did.
trader isn't going to have anything I need. They do sit up in strange places. Oh, that's a pig. Wait. In the middle of a pond? Yeah. I like to think of when that's the case that, you know, like something bad happens. <laughs> My bees. Whoa, look at all the fish. Oh. This is my old house up here. I was originally going to build up there, but it, I guess I changed my mind. Oh, there's even some charcoal left. And some salt, which is probably dry by now. This is the house that I've abandoned. My greenhouse with the peanuts. Pineapple. Oh my god, that is so many carrots. I guess I might have to do some cooking uh, before I leave again. Like half of these things I can't even grow up at my place. I can grow, grow the soy and the rice, but it's too hot for everything else. That's my... Oh, my cranberries are ready to harvest. Oh shit, I forgot about these guys. Olive tree, apple tree. We take cuttings from those actually. It's both yellow, right? Oh yeah, look at that. I've got a bunch of black currants I can harvest too. Sweet. I can't it's too warm at my my new place for berries to grow. What I can do is harvest <laughs> Um Oh there we go. Toast got the torch out the right yesterday. Um, I can harvest some while I'm process. Oh, the seaweed is still good? That's so funny. Vegetable Hey! Hey Drax, I've got some veggie broth. Onion only, please. Oh, you're so picky. Prepare to die. Ooh, candy. I'll leave that there. Okay. 
star. My little house. Guess I'll just put these in here for now. Don't let me forget putting those in there as well. I get my toast toast gifts gifts. I am putting in storage here so that I do go splat. It's fine. Hey, there's someone outside. That's not cool. Oh, I got booze. Mango cider. Oh, is the server crashing? Oh, no, there we go. Well, I'm trapped in here for a couple of hours. Let's just chuck some mango cider. <laughs> mango cider for the win. Um, hang on, let me show you what the game out is. Right, right there. Me trying to say mango cider for the win. <laughs> Toast. That's the thing, like, yeah, let's just get drunk. It'll be fine. It's so fun. Oh, hey, Flint's playing in Trout at the end. What do I got? Got some grenadine. Got some more mango cider. Some red fruit ale. Sounds interesting. Oh god. Stop. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Not touching the camera. You know what? Let's drink some more cider. All right, I'm I'm full on cider. I've drunk three liters of mango cider, one liter of breadfruit ale, and a liter of <laughs> and a liter of uh, grenadine. It's not me that's moving; it's the world. Five liters of any booze and I'll be definitely swaying. You're not supposed to cook when you're drunk. You can set things on fire. All right, apparently you get over it pretty quickly. Wait. Black soil? Oh, 
Oh, yes, I can bottle it now, huh? You're gonna be like, yes, there's booze. Oh, it's flax oil. Delicious. Yay! All right, so now I need to go up here. But I can just like sail straight across. Oh, that sounds awful. Don't like the idea of that at all. I don't think it will just sail out of you and like projectile. Full on booze, let's go sailing. This is fine. All right, I forgot I have the horse on the map to mark giraffe rock. into the deep ocean. It'll be fine. Good time to have a snack. I just wish it didn't look so gross. I suppose peanut butter doesn't exactly look pretty either, does it? Is the ads coming? In 30 seconds or less. Less. Like, once again, I'm not in a place where I can stop. Also, the almond butter sticks to the roof of your mouth like peanut butter does. I see light. Why am I seeing light there? Oh, wait, what?
What dits? Oh. No, it's all right. I don't I'm going this way. I think. Um, once a very long time ago, here is a little shelter. I have it marked on my map. My main concern is the potential proximity of, like, whoa. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say, bulls and bears. <laughs> uh. Um. Oh, should I have taken that canal then? All right. I'm such a wuss. Like wolves. <laughs> oh, well, fuck. Uh, uh, well, <clears throat> well, I don't, yeah, I was like, I don't, I don't know now. You know what I didn't bring with me is a weapon. I didn't bring a knife. <laughs> All right. Woo! I'd like a little speed there. That's fun. And you're gonna need some speed bumps. This is pretty fucking fancy. I really like the little speed boost though. Every now and then, I think it's just a uh, when the water is going up or down. Wow, already? I can tell this is gonna be really fucking impressive. <laughs> <laughs> right? I'm like living in a shoebox.
<laughs> I'm sorry, Drake. Do you, want, do you want me to look away? It does look like something from Planet Zoo. Look at all the fish, just like... Yeah, I'm just hanging here. It's Jew's place. It's cool. You can... <laughs> Obsidian rock. <laughs> for, for a path. It's like having a gold-plated toilet. It makes it very visible from the map. I like how Stu's got this big fancy ass place and I'm like, oh, there's an empty field. Oh. That. What's over here? It is, it is a lot of obsidian. Don't mind me, Stu, I'm just being nosy. Hello? Okay, that is alarming. Wait. Oh, ugh. Ugh. Obsidian, very good toast. The pigs? I guess. Pigs or goats? Goats. Stew's so fancy, even the livestock have their own private islands. I know, right? Well, I really like what you've done with the place. It's a good start. It's a really good indoor-outdoor flow. The lighting is fabulous. What's that? Oh, breadfruit tree. Uh... A salty place? Alright. I was a little bit concerned with the whole, you know, skull on a stick thing. Like, that's a weird popsicle. Oh my god, that's so cute. Pineapples! Flax? Flax. I was like, wait, is that tinted? That's tinted glass. You so fancy. You don't see queer eye getting on the roof, do you? I would probably do actually. That's noisy. Oh, I like this windmill. That's cute. With the thatch. Someone else with it. Meteoric. Holy crap. Look at this. I have a, <clears throat> really? <laughs> a man fell off a ship into the water and was promised immediate help. However, there was a hold up. What did he do during the delay? He waited. Luke.
<laughs> Leave my reclining her way back. Honestly, this is what it's like. If if you invite me to your house, pop a roofing, I will like go in every room and be like, what's this? Poke, poke, poke. The stew's just patiently waiting for me to stop fucking around. Oh, I like this tune. <laughs> you know I would love to. I was like, wait, what? What? Alright, this is the obsidian machine. So that's, that's lava. And... So the lava drops into the water and becomes obsidian, right? All of these? Are you sure? It feels a little bit, um... So Stu is offering three crates. Wait, no, it can't be all three crates. Crate of, of, of obsidian stone for making stone paths. All three. That is a, I feel like they should make a fancy ass stone path road. Uh, Stu, could you please make a tutorial or point one out to me on how to make obsidian? That is true. Stu said he will do one. Okay. Chickens! Oh god, I caused chicken chaos. I'm sorry. Oh, I need to get some flowers. Stu, this place is amazing. Well, this looks ominous. Oh, I got one of them thingies. Wait, no, I don't. I thought I did. I don't. Stu, whose body is that? Drax, blink twice if you need rescuing. Oh, I have a gold Omok piece. <laughs> uh, Stuart has been signed off work for a wee while. Um, so he has a lot of time for the story. This is really cool. An aged trash can. This reminds me, this room reminds me of, hmm. I can't remember what game it was, where they had like everyday objects and treated as like museum items. I don't know what Flint's up to. 
Um, yeah, I can't remember what game it was, but this reminds me of that. Metal barrel. That's cool. The corroded copper block. This is really cool, Stu. What is that? Oh god. What it Stu Yeah. Ooh, look at all the lightning rods. And so I'm like, ooh, lightning. All right, we are, wait, guys, we need to step up our game. <gasps> look, floating shrubbery. I love it. All right. <laughs> the stew's still sitting, sitting in his house. All right, play. Bye. All right. <laughs> Hi. Oh, I like your flowers. That's cute. There's an upstairs and a cellar too. Okay, let's have a look in the cellar. This better not be a trap. You says don't enter. Bye. <laughs> nice knowing you. Hotel California place, right? Oh god, I'm lost already. Okay. Oh, never mind. I'm good. I can be lost here. <gasps> look at all that honey. Oh, look, Drax, this is for you. All the. <laughs> this is the room for Drax to get lost in. Okay, this is really cool. For a minute there, I thought this was going to turn into a maze. Alright, that's the. This is very nice. Uh, th th this. Oh, look at these cool storage containers. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, cheese. Do not look at the cheese. For he who looks at cheese shall crash the server. I, 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 I'm not far from just like... Uh, <laughs> lifting up the rugs to look after the, under the rugs. Alright. That's cool. Oh, oh my god, really? You have educational artwork. Wow. How bright and colorful this is. Look at all, them. Look at all their fishies. Re oh, that's a record player. Oops.
What? I keep forgetting about display cases. It's a circle. Stew, Lord of all he sees. Or oh, some fancy surveys. Some fancy word. This is so cool. Oh my god, you can have tree saplings inside? Yes. You look very fancy. Raining party! Hey! Cracked! This stew is an accomplished. Artist, art, artifact, architect, architect, dragon, dragon frags. Hey, trucker DJ. Hi, frags. Thank you for the raid. <laughs> Hi, Katho. I've been fragged. Were you working on the Valentine's thing? It's super cool. We all love your players, Stu. Um. Okay, bye. Bye, Echo. Yay! Thank you for the follow. Ah, oh, there's a pepper truck. I hope you had a wonderful stream. Uh, so welcome in, everyone. Hello, hi. Uh, ch chat does that. Um, I'm Del, Delirio. Uh, my pronouns are she, her. I'm currently touring a very impressive estate by a friend here on Vintage Story and then I'm about to go back to my my little mud hut <laughs> um Vintage Story uh started off as a mod for Minecraft but is now its own legally distinct thing and it is very very cool and I enjoy it Right, if you need to go get food I know it's late for you um Let's, let's go do a self-care. It is not Minecraft. Um, it is legally distinct and very much not Minecraft right now, but... Um, but yeah. Okay, awesome. That sounds fantastic. Yeah, go, go, go stand up and, and get, get, a, get some food and get a beer in ya. Um, I guess I need to go get some rocks, huh? Mac and cheese, yes. Bring some back for me, please. Hey, you've got a crab one too. All right, good night, Katho. To see ya. What? You have some road? Um, which would be the most convenient for you? Like the road? Okay. Mmm, delicious. Crunchy road. Okay. The the road has been taken. I have taken the Oh, it wasn't the high road or the low road, was it? Thank you. Uh I'm uh I'm like, I'm, I'm lost. <laughs> yep, like, I don't know if I'm gonna have space for it all. I suppose I can, like, cut some of it down. Alright. Like, I have, I have to save four inventory spaces for... Well... Um... Got some things I can toss here, but I have to save for like four inventory spaces for the things that Toast gave me for the opening the portal. I know, I'll just eat my inventory. Oh, 
All right, I've taken as much as I can. My inventory is full now. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat> so how far is Drex from here? I can still see my little, like, ambling path. Sixteen eighty. Oh. Wait, what? I don't know how to use this. I don't know how to use the map. 480. Oh god, you're... Up here. Oh, oh, geez. All right, they're the vague, vague area where there's no whale icon. Other way. Oh. Oh. Hey, Mark. Oh, okay. Oh, snake. Snake. Okay. <sighs> All right, let's get this stuff back down to my place. Nick. I shall I shall visit once the engineering works are are complete. I'm like, wait, how do I get out of this place again? Wait. What's the... Oh. What is that? That's... Oh, did you find that in a ruin? That's cool. That means we could... Chisel that. Oh, that's curious. Who do you suppose that is? You think it might be Jonas? I haven't I haven't read any of the lore. Lore tends to go in one ear and out the other, or in one eye and out the other. In three parts. That's really cool. Oh yeah, head, torso, and face. That's super cool. Yeah. You're so fancy, Stu. You're so fancy. Thank you for sharing your home with us.
Nah. Yeah, it's it's void water. It's delicious. Delicious, refreshing void. Whee! What you don't you don't drink void? It's good for you. It's rehydrating. I did not think about the chroma key when I bought my bottle. <laughs> um, but now I've got used to drinking void on a daily basis. The destroy beer does also hydrate. I do have some beer. <laughs> yes, it does. Nothing a bucket can't fix though. Really? Or a bottle, I guess, if you want to stay in the whole, like, trucking vibe. So, I'm gonna... I may have to pass a few things. Oh my god, if, look, I have my sling with me. It's my only weapon. So if I get into a fight, I'm going to be throwing obsidian at people. That just feels so extra. It's like... Trying to fight someone with gold foil. <laughs> oh, stop. Stop. I just realized I have candy. I can't open it. I'm so weak, I can't even open my candy bag. Cola bottles! You already said you were hungry. Don't give me that bullshit. Besides, everyone knows that you can fill up on booze. Just drink more beer. Easy. This truck is full. All right. Do you hear that trucker? Now I'm going to find a bunch of cool ruins. You went easy on the BSC. That's the problem. It's the problem there. I've forgotten what my landmarks look like now. There's so much variation in color here. Is giraffe rock? It's a rock that looks like a giraffe. Loosely. It is. It's fucking gorgeous. So this is where... I initially decided to set up my, my base. But I have since moved. Giraffe rock. Um, because it was too rainy and it was making me grumpy. And we found most things make me grumpy. 
But this bay was just... It's a really pretty spot. So I have to Abe's place and I've got this little tiny spot. With my tatty overgrown garden. Oh, you know. Gotta... Oh, hey, the olive tree's flowering. Aren't you there? Flowering for about 4.2 days. Right. This music is just so bizarre. Um, you know what? I could leave this here. I've got so I've got three inventory spaces so what I could do is make a bunch of fruit syrup so I could transport 30 liters of fruit syrup with me Maybe. I don't know if that's the best use of use of my space. Wait. Bottles stack up to 16, right? So I could take three. So I could take more. 64 liters. No. 48 liters. She's like, I can see Dell's brain working. All right. Let's get juicing. This is fine. Wait, have I got a scythe in here? I should replant this garden. I'm never going to leave this place now. May as well replant it. So even even though I'm not using it, if someone else comes by and they're hungry, it has supplies. But leave the flex there.
I think I was struggling with grass at some point, and now I'm just like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, I'm cool. I've got lots of grass. Even know where it went. I need bigger inventory, please. Oh, fuck. Oh, I guess I'm gathering that now, huh? I don't even know what I'm scooping up here. I'm not- I'm not really doing a good job thinking this through. How about if I put these in here? The way that the scythe just like freaks the fuck out when you pick things up. I'm gonna leave like food in there. You know what? I should put that fresh for 48 days. Is that it? Oh, man. It's still good. I keep thinking, it's like, you know what? I haven't had a crash yet from using auto sort. That's how you set yourself up for failure. All right, what do we got? It is March now, it is nine degrees, so we can pretty much plant in. Onions. Parsnips. Cabbages. Carrots, flax. Spelt. Got it. I can't grow any root vegetables up north or oh, down south.
things about Eric. I feel like flags would be more useful. now if anyone comes through here there's gonna be food oh I should check to see if I've got any hot foods to plant in there I may have grabbed it all Soybeans. Let's plant some soy in there. I'm gonna leave the peanuts too. Alright, that makes me feel better. Like I'm leaving the, the garden in good condition for the next people. What are we? We've got a six minutes until... Six minutes until the next cycle for the roofs. Honestly, I was expecting to have more fruit. I always meant to uh, move the other berry bushes into this area. Oh, I guess I should shut this. No, no, it sounds miserable and cold, Drax. Mmm, 
Yeah. Crazy. Oh, no, Joe, you need to get out and push. You jumping on it? I still don't know how I'm supposed to dry those now. Mmm, berries. All that vitamin C. There's normally a couple of bushes around here. Maybe. Funny. No, I know there's a cave over there. It's dark and I cannot see. Oh no! Charmin! I think I need to wait for the sun to come up. I don't, I wanted to get some more clippings, cuttings of fruit trees too, but that's going to have to be a different trip, I think. Get some more firewood done too.
230. <clears throat> All right. Hey, that's a useful thing for chat logs. I can go back and see when it was that I put, di put dinner on the slow cooker. Because I couldn't remember. I think maybe it's a little bit ambitious about being able to transport 48 liters of syrup. I don't think I'd be able to have enough berries to make 48 liters of syrup. Well, sorry, I don't think I have a saw. Nor do I have enough copper to do anything. Oh! Oh no, I put that in there. Okay. Uh, right. Uh, we are about to have an ad break. Uh, and because I'm in a safe place, I'm gonna stand up and stretch and uh, get a drink. You guys should also stand up and stretch, uh, hydrate, pet the dog, get a snack. And I will see you back here in a few minutes. Uh, a watch pot will absolutely boil. Watch this. You won't believe what happens next. Saw that.
Well, now we know. A watch pot will boil. Alright, got coffee. Head away and put rice on for dinner for later. Put the rice cooker on. It's magic! I love my rice cooker. Every I go through stages where I just like use it all the time and then I forget that it exists. Seven and a half liters of cranberry syrup. Oh, I can't drink it. I'm just gonna... Yeah. That's fine. Just madly flailing. Oh, did we get a weird look? Here we go. Don't try and accuse me of cheating. I'm not trying to dupe things. Let's see if I can just go get like one more red current from somewhere. So we've got two even stacks. What I had. A couple of bushes are in here. Also, I'm going to need food. I was hoping I'd get have more light currents. I love black currants. Giraffe frog. I think I've I've come to the realization that I'm gonna have to just make another trip. Because I want flowers. I don't necessarily have to come all the way this way, but I want flowers. And there's not a huge variety of flowers where I am. I wonder if the pan- no, wait, the panda moved. It was the panda location, but I did kill a panda? Nope, there it is! Hey, buddy! Long time no see! That panda really likes the carrots. I think that's that's why he hangs out where he does because there's a carrot spawn right there. See, right to the parrot, right, right on the carrots. Wait, has he seen me? He's so cute. No, ah, uh, did not. There's nothing to see there. He's just having a nap. <laughs> He's gone on holiday. Um, you pining for the fjords? Exactly. Exactly. Uh, Baird, I tried your suggestion and I love it.
but they uh oh god that's a lot of pigs wait what is going on with that tree i mean i guess look at this happy little farm chickens and pigs all hanging out that redwood tree is just like going for it Let it go. I just want to cut it down. I'm such a terrible human. What is that over there? It's just a tree trunk, isn't it? Or is that another? Oh, is that another panda? Are the pandas breeding? Oh, it's another panda. It's a panda butt. Okay. I felt a little bit guilty for pinging you about it, but also it was delicious, so I figured that would be okay. It's not like I do it all the time. Ants! But yeah, because the the almond butter, it's almost like frosting at the moment. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it's it's delicious. I'm look, I'm seriously just trying to find like one more red currant. Yeah, in three weeks I, I'll be like starving, crawling along the ground, barely enough strength to pull myself forward. The other 63 berries in my inventory will have rotted long time ago. But I finally found that one red currant berry. It's, a, it's such a tragic tale. It really is. I felt like that piece of music was perfect for it as well. I, <laughs> I wait for... Um, Cinematic and mysterious today. So I hope you're all feeling mysterious or something. Look, I know that's going to be this ridiculous. I literally just want one more berry so I can finish the stack. All right, so we got 17 minutes of calm. That helps. There's always, there's always berries over here. Cranberries? I want cranberries. I want red currant. <sighs> I wanted to, to take like some good quality dirt back with me as well, some peat. I know there's Pete over there.
Because I've only got medium quality soil, but honestly, that's not really an urgent thing right now. <laughs> Thanks, Baron. I totally hear that now, every time. Every time. Tracks. Every time. I'm cursed. Oh, am I? Did I just eat that? Oh no, I put it in my inventory. I was like, what the heck? <sighs> hey, it's Mark. Wow, this is like busy server today. Um, of Drax saying, Hi, I'm Peter, but my friends call me Pete. Either that or the satisfactory power down sound. Oh, I don't think I could handle that. Oh, I miss turnips. Uh, so it's a it, the uh, hi I'm Peter is just a, a point redemption in Drax's channel. Um, and it's from a character in Grounded, I think. The game Grounded. Yeah. A character whose name is Peter, but his friends call him Pete. Yeah. I... I Every now and then I'm like, I should add that satisfactory sound effect of like the power getting cut or... Um... Something like that, but I it it terrifies me. Every time I hear it, I panic. And I'm already jumpy as all hell, so I don't think I need more. It's funny how things become a thing. My own hungry tutor team. wolves no see I, I like being able to make drags jump but, but not the other way around I don't want not the other way around that, that's not how no no uh, oh I'm gonna need firewood Oh. I guess there's plenty of trees to chop down. The 
this one seems as good as any. Since I'm not trying to preserve the environment now. Really? You tossed out the eggs? Egg. That is true. That is a very good point. Actually, it's a terrible point, but oh god. I'm in the tree? Ah, oh, thanks, Oak. This this isn't this is uh no stop it. This is my uh, uh, just a a temporary spot actually. Um, is is a uh, I don't know like a comfort shelter. This is going to make another awkward amount to... Oh, it's already got a full stack. Uh, 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 there, there, there. Alright, we're gonna put those on the air. Them in the air. May as well load up on the firewood. Oh, that's gonna hurt. And then, uh, well, Oh, they didn't light properly. Fuck's sake. Figured since I'm here, I might as well fill up the firebox. So if anyone else needs to use this place as shelter, there's, you know, stuff for cooking.
pop, 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 pop. Okay. And we've got the garden replanted. Uh, olive tree is aggressively. Flowering. So I think we're going to be leaving this in, in a good condition. A stake of 600 firewood is nothing to be sniffed at, I reckon. I would have liked more uh, fruit syrup, but... Ooh, excuse me. I think this is still a good deal. Such a mess. Bye, Mark! I don't have... Oh, right. I don't have a saw. So I may just have to take a bucket. Wait. Two. Oh, I. Mm. Oh, why am I doing that? I could just do this. Wait, what's this? Another one and a half liters of cranberry syrup. Fuck's sake. What's that going to break down into? Five, there's going to be exactly five liters, right? Oh. I have extra bottles. This is handy. Chug some syrup.
All right, give it any second now. Five liters. I was hoping for more, but... Teapot. Here you go. Middle parts and a gear. Don't leave a partial stick here, I think. I can't leave my teapot behind. Also, I think I'm going to take. gelatin that I have here because gelatin is such a pain on the butt to make. Switch these things out here. So we've got rocks, some paths, free gelatin. I've got 13 liters of syrup. I think that'll do. But I know I'm just like, ah, oh, but look at all those carrots. Look at all those carrots. <laughs> it's fine. I just make a lot of carrot juice, but I don't have a saw to make bottles. Worst comes to worst, they turn into rot. All right, it is time. Head back south. We've got about 
six minutes before... <clears throat> the next rift cycle. I feel like I've forgotten something. I think it's okay. Yeah, so I, I put two points, two survival points into being able to have a a, a larger pool for food. Which is useful. But it constantly makes me panic because I think that I'm more hungry than I am. I see it down to half. Not realizing that that is basically the full bar for without the the mod, so I'm like panic eating. So I'm actually tempted to take those points off. And put them elsewhere because I guess it's not really wasting food. Yeah, no, I know what the numbers are. They, uh, it takes a second for them to, to update though. So you, you can't just like chug food, you've got to wait for it, the graph to, to update or the food vanishes. But always panic when hungry. Like always panic when hungry because food hungry toots toots. You spent over- oh my god, you must have a headache. A lot. I still haven't found iron. But I, I guess I have the meteors, so... Yes, it balances out. Look, oh, red currants. Cranberries. All sorts of berries right here. Erks. That's right, I wanted to get a tree cuttings. I'm gonna have to do that on another trip too. Oh, I can smell the rice. I put lunch on or dinner on in the slow cooker at about 2.30. Eight now. Let's put the rice cooker on before.
We have a nice toasty warm dinner. I love, I love my slow cooker. I love my instant pot, but I love my slow cooker more. If I could get a slow cooker lid for my instant pot. <gasps> yes. Uh, if I could get a slow cooker lid for my instant pot, I would be so very happy. Oh yeah, it's March. You said they fruit around April, right? It. April, May. It's really dark and I cannot see. Good night, Jerx. Mango, lychee, pomegranate, breadfruit, olive, orange. Got it. Well, I've already got... I've got mango fruiting already. I know where some lychee trees are, but I haven't... Um... I haven't got around to picking any out. This is such a strange playlist, but I'm enjoying most of it. All right, we are on the toasty road. Well, that's the answer to it all then, isn't it? I've got pomegranates and I think <laughs> no I ran away <laughs> I think I have an olive tree I have one mango bunch of pomegranate I feel like the the disappointing part of with all these path blocks in in rocks or stones is that they're gonna be gone in like no time. <laughs>
I don't even think I've seen. Wait, have I seen an orange tree? Orange and lychee. Oh, orange and lychee were closer to your place. Your old place. And then bunches of pomegranates and olives. Breadfruit and mango to the west. That's what I need to do is go just like looking for the trees and take cuttings. But I'll wait until after everything's finished fruiting now. Last couple of weeks have just been so exhausting. red hue over everything just before the sun comes up is so airy especially now that there's only a few seconds left in the cycle I fully expect it to, to pop apocalyptic because I don't have any building materials on me I guess I could try and build out of a stone pile at least all the sun is coming up soon so Three, two, one. What do we got next? Another 10 minutes of calm. Yay! The vintage, the vintage story gods are kind to us today. <sighs> Such yawns. My brain just has to intercede before I start heading to toast. I have to make sure I remember to turn through the, the, the street of toast rather than visit the house of toast. So we stick into the purple arrows. Not the orange ones. I have color coded them.
All right, so I think what we'll do is... Oh my god, <laughs> I've still got so far to go. I think I'll just take, drop everything off at home before I do anything. I always think I'm closer and then I'm like, oh god, I'm only halfway. <laughs> oh. Whose idea was it to live so far away? Honestly. Whoa, it's a bridge. Check this out. No, it's a whole fucking city. It's a sunken village. With a lot of stuff. I did not see that before. Look at that one. I'm so scared. What if there's horrible things in here? It's like... Alright. I... I can't. I gotta... Uh... I don't... I don't have to... I can't right now. I can't. Yes! Post, there is a massive underwater ruin really quite close to your place if you want to go check it out. Like, it's huge. Whoa. I bet there's some cool stuff in there. We gotta be. I'm getting off course. I'm pretty glad that I put down these little like directional markers on my mini map. I guess it was just the angle of the sun meant that I could see that ruin because I've been through there I don't know how many times now. And I completely missed it. It's 
is a really interesting area. These plateaus. Hey, Google just paid me to say, paid me 10 cents to say I don't live in North Carolina. Whoopsie. Oh, for some reason, I thought I needed to dig my way through here. Oh, do we have some termites? Can I can I have a nibble on some termites, please? Some termite mounds. Paddles pouch. Is it like a little sling? So many hyenas. Jeez. Oh, what's that? Oh, quartz. Yeah. Now you gotta check. Oh, we have ad swapping. Oh God, already in 30 seconds. Less than 30 seconds. Uh, good time for an ad break. Can. Stand up, stretch. Like I can't even eat them. Oh no! <laughs> Mark! Oh, I guess if I get like super hungry, I can just have some of my syrup. Love I like how Mark's like, I don't know, Mark hasn't spent that much time in the server and is already just like, you know what, I'm gonna take on some lava. Bring it. Yeah, that pomegranate tree is flowering for sure. 
I wish I checked that ruins for a food box. Didn't, I didn't really think about food for the return journey. Something flowering over here. Flowering or fruiting? Oh, that's a breadfruit tree. Bread for it. Oh, here we go. Bamboo here. Let's, uh... What these little fingers? Oh, you found it? It's huge. There's like a cathedral. I'm very, I was very interested in it, but my, ba my, my bags be full. Bags too full for that bullshit. something really intriguing about underwater villages like the, the like the flooded villages that you get when dams are, are broken that sort of thing just always really gets me intrigued it's kind of grim fascinating chicken I really want to get chickens started. There's so many around where I am. It shouldn't take long to wrap a good number of them. All right. Man, this is such a big mission. I really wish I had larger. This is like the only time where I'd be tempted into that uh, mod that lets you carry more.
Holy. Alright. Of course, the hyena is chasing me. Screw you, buddy. At some point, I want to, you know, get a road this way, but <laughs> I'm going to work on my smaller, shorter road there first before I start thinking along those lines. Can I even explore? No, look. Fruity fruit here. And go fruit. I have gorged upon bamboo root. Oh shit, yeah, another 20 minutes of calm. Good spotting. I am totally 100% okay with this. Especially for this leg of the journey, because this bit really sucks when it's not calm and dark. And to think I used to be scared to step foot out of my house. Rain is such a good sound. One of the things that I really enjoy um, about this game, specifically when I'm not streaming, is that I can... I don't have music playing all the time, so I can enjoy the environmental sounds a lot more. All these chickens.
like I, I enjoy the music. I try and I do try and play playlists that I enjoy, but usually if I am not streaming, I have the lights off. Like I'll be sitting in my room in the dark and no no other sound sources, just whatever the game is. The, um, I tell you what, with this, this plane here, it really, really pays. Pay attention to the mini map. Like, really pays. Look at the mini map because there's so many massive fucking holes on the ground. Some of them are dug by me, but there's just a lot of pits like that. Oh, that made my stomach lurch just looking at it. easy to pick out where my place is on a map now. So many trees. Hello, house. My trees. Oh, my olive tree is flowering as well. Flowering for about 1.6 days. Oh my gosh, how pretty is that? Look, the the flower petals are blowing off. It's so pretty. Soon I'm gonna have too much fruit. I really wish you could just like lean the raft against a wall. All right. So that is uh, pre-gelatin, so we're going to put that there.
I've got eight liters of cranberry syrup. I have extra bottles now. And five liters. Of red Karen syrup. Shelf for my teapot. That is very important. Well, I guess it's dark, but uh, um, so let's build some road. Do we want it? Along here. Apparently that tree has to go. Whoopsie. I'm sorry, tree. Thank you. All. Don't mind if I do. Welcome back.
The sip has been sipped. You get dinner too? Nice. Jab. I put dinner in a slow cooker well before stream, so I'm just waiting for... Um the rice cooker to yell at me. Good salad and crispy yum. I did my um my cream cheese chicken today easy thing as my treat i am going to have almond butter and graham crackers it's it's weird i think i managed to make the the almond butter it's almost a non-newtonian fluid it looks way more liquid than it is like it moves like jello but it's not the creamiest looking I tell ya, it's it came out really good. I only put like I don't know, that's just that's over a cup worth, but I put like a tablespoon of honey in there. And it's just delicious. Uh it's a little ninja thing. It's like the motor is a when they sort of it, it attaches on top. But it had to uh, I did have to make it easy because I could feel it warming up. I did have um I had one from Walmart and there was nothing wrong with it but it didn't I definitely didn't have enough to deal with making nut butter it's the first time I tried it the other one I think I was trying to do was um
make a uh, grind down coconut make a coconut paste but I I hadn't tried this one this was just one that um see that I, I think Plintspum found in a thrift store. He definitely didn't get it new. But it's definitely got a, a good amount of strength and torque in it. Oh, you mean the almond butter with the honey and the cinnamon? I reckon that would work. Ooh, oh yeah, that sounds really good. Definitely. You made Kirk? Nice. Oh, that works. I keep thinking at some point we ought to do like a, a stream recipe book. Bryn gets to like pick their favorite recipe and submit it. Yeah, because I think there's a few of us that have got like favorite baking recipes or, you know. honestly surprised I I would I actually think if the next time I do it I won't use I think I use probably I don't know like maybe a tablespoon two teaspoons or a tablespoon of coconut oil um I don't think I would even use that much next time I need to eat or something. Yeah, that'd be great. Honestly, it's like we just, uh, so our 
three times now our neighbors have dropped off like a box of food and they they said they've basically been to the food bank and they've it's it's been they've been given too much so they don't want it to go to waste but in every bag in every box they've given us has been a two pound bag of almonds and i don't don't eat almonds i just don't enjoy the flavor on their own and I don't have the patience to sit there and like blanch them and slice them finely for baking or anything. And then I was like, wait, isn't almond butter a thing? Can't I make almond butter? It could be. Or they just aren't interested in them. So I thought maybe... Now I know it works. Maybe I could take some over. Make them a, a jar of almond butter as a thank you for them bringing us good food. Because there's twice now there's been like a massive pork roast as well. Like, which has served like three meals or more. Ooh. So it'd be it'd be nice to, you know, to be able to do something. Say thank you. Ooh. I didn't thought about that. If they don't like if they don't like almond they don't like almond i mean that's that's totally fine but i was like whoa what do i do And considered that as a thing. <laughs> I'm sure that's a thing, maybe. It's really good. I feel very proud of myself for making it. <laughs> I've been munching on it all day. Thank you. Mm. Actually, speaking of munching on it all day. I'll be right back. I need to go chicken with rice. Oop. Might be a tick.
Hmm. I am back with food. Uh, found the book, posted it in the channel. Okay. Oh. Nut butters. Chipotle, almond, and honey but Ooh. Okay. I can see how that would work. Because that's just, you know, like you use a peanut sauce for, um, like satay. I can see how that would work. Thank you for sharing it. All right. Apparently, the rice had been ready for quite a while, but thankfully I had the, the rice cooker on warm. making sure I'm not wearing it. Oh hey, it's daytime! Wee! I love how the... Pretty is that, that the flower petals like fly off. Hi Jeannie! You should. You should absolutely make it again. Thank you, Jenny. I'm having a good day, thank you. Just, uh, you know, messing about, building paths and... Apparently not... Doing a very good. I didn't. I didn't mark out the potential path very well, but important. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So I did a big adventure back up to my old place. Got uh, a bunch of stones from Stu's place, and got some fruit syrup because I can't grow berries here. And now I've come back to oh yeah, and the bits and pieces to do the, oh the translocator post. <laughs> this is the new temporary place. This is a, a staging area until I can. Um, get my words done. I was just like, oh, I've got nowhere to put this stuff. Or I could just like dig a hole. Or put a crate somewhere. I 
I'm so glad you said that, Doris. I got so distracted. Like, that never happens. Alright, so... You... You... Inconvenient? What's that? Blue play. All right. Uh, this way. Um. Oh, I mean, I can, I can nudge it. I could nudge it to Thursday. I don't think anyone said anything about having plans. I'll I'll have the um I'll upload the clip as well to I'll highlight it and upload it to to Twitch and YouTube. I forgot about quartz being there as well. Your office? Oh, right. Yeah, that's right. I'm I'm trying to get better about posting stuff on there. So far, I'm just doing uh, VODs. Um. Because I don't, I don't know what else to do, but I really ought to start, like, streaming over there too. <laughs> I think, I think Pod liked what you liked your post, Brickley. Um, but yeah, the last couple of times I streamed, I did my craft streams over there as well, like a dual stream them. And I did have people pop in. But I tried streaming on TikTok as well, but it was just a bit weird. Felt a bit strange. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I've uh, I, tr I tried to make it easy to, to you know match up to everything. I've stopped pushing videos out to subscribers. Um because apparently that can actually do some harm in a really weird roundabout way. So if you you get people subscribing to your channel for content about X, whatever X is, um, and then you start publishing content about Y, but you're still sending it out to the subscribers who are only interested in X, then you get like, it shows lower engagement. Which is fair enough. Um, but then you're you're sort of punished for it. So it's like, okay. Weird. So I'm like, I'm just trying to remember to turn off the notifications for everyone. 
but there's so like all of my vods from last year i think are up there uh and i'm trying to to get more so All right, are we are we ready to find out where this translocator goes? Adventure. It, it tells me where it's gonna go oh i don't want to know all right let's find out whoa okay Oh, I am. I'm super underground. I'm just gonna let the map finish loading. A water closet. Yeah, it looks like it. some proper tools oh boy that wheel was spinning too hi hello all right so where is that over here That's an interesting looking area. 2866, 12, 11, 297. <laughs> yeah, that's gotta be it. Close enough. All right, so I need, um, I need a weapon, obviously. I was hoping that it would send me, like, north. Oh, we have an ad break coming up, man. I didn't I didn't really think about that. Okay, we have ads right now. But again, I'm not in a great spot to stop, so not gonna. Oh, 
I was like, no, I don't want to die. Thank you for the biddies to open it up. First. I think I need to, to uh... Get a weapon. And, uh, go back. <laughs> go back in there with some actual useful tools. I keep on forgetting about it. It's like I had my sling, but I didn't have any uh, ammo for sling. forgetting about all these hyenas out here too so I should probably take a door and a torch as well for a, a bowl So if nothing else, it's it's a safe little spot to hide in. Did you find anything good in the underground village, Josh? The underwater village, sorry. I don't know, I feel like you should be able to find like really cool stuff in there. Let's find out what the next cycle is. We've had three calm spells in a row. What do we got now? Normal. All right. I was almost expecting apocalyptic after that. Ali, I hope you had a good day at work. Sorry, I got like super distracted there by a, a portal I went through. I'm also distracted by my food. Um, 
Tell me about this chicken waffle sub. Much better. Good. Okay, good. good. Oh, fuck. That sounds even better than I was anticipating. This, this insider info is very handy. Oh, that was a batch made of salt. See, that's what it is. Why have I still just got a copper one? Why don't I have a meteoric one? I don't think I've ever had chicken and waffles as a combination. And honestly, I'm kind of right there with like, what the fuck? But also I love waffles and I love fried chicken. So I feel like this could only be a win. That's always sad when that happens. I am so... Like, look at this. The flower petals are blowing off the trees. It's so cute!
the olives like the pomegranates are flowering the olives are flowering You know, mm. is there a no? Never mind. Don't answer that. You can't answer that because I didn't finish asking the question. Is it I'm hungry or someone's throwing shit at me? It's hard to tell sometimes. take that with me <sighs> I don't know if it's bright enough here really need to make more play balls just uh, clay balls. Is that the one that I was using? Yeah. So, I mean, I guess if I'm eating at one, I should make well this heat up two. I'm done with it. I should probably take letters as well, right? How far down was it? 12. So it's like a hundred units underground.
Oh, I forgot about how annoying this was. There's something to be said about being able to smelt things rather than smith. Ooh, this is dramatic. don't know what I want here. All else fails. Pick. Speed's fault. Look at me, Black. Oh, Ollie! Oh my God, yes. I'm singing the song of my people, or something. I hadn't even thought about that till now. That's so cool. Oopsie. Hey. There it goes. All right, so, oh. That's what you wanted. Okay, so I have I'm getting quite the surplus of tools going on here. I have a decent weapon on me now. I should probably take a stack of rocks just to throw at people, just in case. Cause you never know. Got a bunch of letters. Why do we have a bucket? I don't want a bucket. 
have some food. We have bandages. I have a torch. I have a stack of rocks. I feel like that's well, I mean, I don't know, but I feel like that's good a good supply of materials to venture into the unknown with. There's nothing there that can't be replaced, so I can just abandon my body if I need to. Oh, no, I want to make a... I want a door. A stack of stones to throw at people? A door. I mean, it sounds reasonable. Did I wait until daylight though? A few years ago, we were having problems with the neighbor's dogs getting out all the time. Um, I bitched about it a fair amount in Dean's Discord, so you probably rem might remember. Um, but they were not very well looked after doggos. Um, and they were, they would frequently come into our yard and then growl. Like if I went to go check the mailbox, they, like, they wouldn't run at me, but they would come towards me growling. And it made me so mad. And we called the cops and the cops were like, just shoot them. <laughs> and I was like, no, it's not the dog's fault. It's the owners who need to look after their animals. And so my, I don't, they got dark. Um, but what I ended up doing is uh, a few years before Flint had been given a slingshot for Christmas as a joke gift. And we had a path full of acorns. So I just started shooting them with acorns. Every time they came into the yard, I just like popped them off and I got really good shot. It was like, Pew. They didn't like being shot in the butt with acorns or in the snoot. It was like one of those, you know how you go to like Target and they have like gifts for under $10 for men it was one of them bullshit things. Wait, what? Opaque black glass? Luminous, opaque, black glass. Boop. Yeah, they got booped with acorns. So for a little while there, I was a pretty good shot with acorns. It's so pretty. Again, this would be like another good little Oh god, hiccups. Zen thing. With the rain and... the flower petals. I really want to replant this garden. I'm letting the soil rest. Wait, the... what is this playlist doing? What is this? We've had like, like from this, the Swan Lake to like world music from various cultures in this playlist. It's just been all over the place. Drum and bass, bicycle.
I don't want to start running out in case the next cycle is apocalyptic, but I mean, if it is, it is. It's not really much I can do about it anyway. So make sure that I turn the oven off. Except for those ones, those are allowed to be left on. Okay. So let's go back to... The translocator. But this time... I have a weapon. And a door. So I can get in there, put a door up, clear out the room a bit. Oh, the sun's coming up. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Slowly anyway. So it, it turns out that almond butter is really good on graham crackers. In case anyone has missed me talk about that full stream, just want to reiterate. Almond butter is really good on graham crackers. And I keep on trying to convince myself that the almond butter that I made is healthy. Uh, but I haven't had any feedback telling me, agreeing with me, so maybe it's it's not. I don't, don't know. I mean, not, not so good for you, right? Little protein. Well, I mean, I, I thought it would be. It's got like, in that much, there's like half a teaspoon of salt and like a, a tablespoon of honey and maybe a tablespoon of coconut oil. I think the next batch, I wouldn't put as much coconut oil in. It, it's pr the the killer bit's probably the fact that I'm s smearing it. Uh, Ali, are you drunk? <laughs> I'm sm smearing it on uh, graham crackers. Ali, are you drunk? You know. Have you had a tasty biff? I think I think so. All right. It's the consistency of this stuff. Like I guess it I put in like a tablespoon of coconut oil. Or a cat bumping the keyboard. That's probably more like it. Um or wrangling a bowl of ice cream. You're oh, oh my god. <laughs> Holly. Ali is typing on the phone while in the. Sh you know what? I appreciate your dedication. Strangely enough, you're not the first person to take stream into the shower. Uh, <laughs> um. Wow, stream, stream. It's true though. One of one of my other mods, we used to always take stream into the shower. She's like, all right, let's go or <laughs> we'll pile into the shower. Like, don't forget to wash behind your ears. You missed a bit. 
Um, I completely forgot what I was saying now. I'm far too entertained. Okay. Let's try this again. Okay. The door is in. Empty, remove, run, remove all. Play. Oh, I was standing on. Oh no, this jerk me off. Okay, there was an invisible block. Curious. Look, stop winding up. Oh shit, look at that. 16 rusty ears and a copper torque. And a ruined bed? What is that? He's got like spiky bits. does ours <laughs> why has he got spiky bits Oh, that's nice. Is that is that a nightmare drifter? I don't want to get too close and find out. Hello? Hmm. 
my concern here is that he's getting pushed this way by the water so if i open the door he's gonna be able to get me the corrupt drifter I'm, I'm I'm not I think what I'll do is I'll put that there oh geez Stu hey Stu do you want an adventure I found an adventure for Stu. There was a translocator at my house. And it spits out into... This room here. Oh hey, metal scrap. Uh, and, and there's a corrupt drifter. I'm just going to put a dirt block in there. Um. <laughs> Spits out. So the... The translocator is actually above ground. It spits out to a nightmare toilet, yeah. And it... It's at the other end, it's at... 12 height. And there's an angry boy. And, and lots of insanity down there. Whoopsie. I don't I don't even know what there is in there, except for one very angry boy. Got a bunch of stuff. Got this like aged crate that's got a picture on it. Okay, well that was interesting. Uh, so, uh, let me just post a screenshot of this. Oh, hey, that's not what I want. And then it spits it out over here. Oh, oh God, prickly. Ugh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I just realized that first screenshot's not actually helpful.
it's it's an interesting movie actually i think that screenshot works <laughs> i put a screenshot in in discord Stu. i don't know if that gives you uh enough information to go off Yeah, it's a it's a movie. Oh, okay. Um Yeah. Yeah, no, it, it's a movie. It, <laughs> it's I I think I was far too young to see that. I feel like I saw that pretty close to when I saw Requiem for a Dream and I I think I may have kind of been put off by movies for a little while by that. It's, it's not that it's particularly, um, it's just dark, I guess. I don't know. I mean, it's a good movie. Ooh. It's just fucked up. <laughs> I, I don't. I'm gonna shut up now. Silence. Oh, jeez. I made the mistake of. I've, I've talked about it before. Um. Hey. Uh, watching. The day I watched Requiem for a Dream, we watched. Whoop. Uh, we watched it after watching Shrek. Uh, which is very much not the right order to do it in. Uh, we should have watched Requiem for a Dream and then Shrek. Uh, so yeah, dec decisions were made that day that were very wrong, and also we were drunk. I don't think I've seen Eyes Wide Shut. I don't know anything about it other than it was Tom Cruise? So I guess I don't know because I'm not entirely sure. and loving it yeah you the movie order makes a big difference for sure ah uh, yeah This was me being brave, by the way. That's the limit of my bravery. Ooh. Oh. Never mind. I was like, ooh, mushrooms. Mm. That's not gonna be good. 
Yeah. Ah. So the sewer right there. Oh god, my arm. What's happened to my arm? You know, Prickly, you don't need to look it up. I'm pretty sure my arm is supposed to be attached to my body. I could be wrong. <laughs> but I could be wrong. I, I could be wrong, yeah. I was all prepared for big adventures and then I went into this eerie adventure place and then I don't want to do adventure anymore. Like, so, ah, uh, I'm good. Thanks. Run away to fight another day. Ah, uh, you know what? David Lynch does pretty fucking weird shit too. So I think that's reasonable. You know what? I don't really need to mark it, but I am gonna. Wait, that's just where I that's where I just came from. Okay. Never mind. I thought my arm may have popped back into socket, but no, it's still floating. Yeah, no, that looks fine. That looks fine. Oh, I fixed it. Oh my god, it. wait, what's that at the top there? Is that fruiting already? <gasps> fruiting pomegranates. Oh I mean, my inventory is full of a bunch of shit. Why am I even messing about with That's olive. It's 
something else over there. That's why. I got some of my road done, and then I remembered that I had the translocator biddies. Oh, uh, I don't, I don't need to. See it. But I, I have started on the road. It's gonna, it's gonna take a while. Actually, it's not, really. No, no, we don't know either. I, I mean, I noticed you'd been quiet for a while, Stu, but beyond that... <laughs> no idea. I, I never make assumptions, because I know, like, you know, I can go quiet sometimes because I'm absorbed in what I'm doing, or... Just never know. Wait it yet? Yeah, waiting for phosphorus to cook. But it's my day off and I go quiet. It could be that I'm like I've gone AFK to do the laundry. Or um no, I got nothing. Glowing glass. So why am I even looking at ruins right now? <laughs> I, I don't know what you're going to do with your glowing black glass, Toes. Without knowing what it looks like, other than, you know, like glass that's glowing. Tars. Hi. Why am I going in here? It is dark. It is scary. Hi. Hi. How you doing? I am okay. I do not want to go in that hole. Oh? What, what was that? Is it when we just set things on fire? Wednesday next week, by the way, we're doing a Sims bonus stream. Start? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I was going to look at that during the next fest, but I got, like, out over games.
I over gamed I mean I played one demo and that was it and it was I was just like oh my god there's so much to do but yeah Wednesday is bonus bonus stream I kind of prefer to not play demos Why won't you go there? Um. Oh. Like I, I'm intrigued by demos, but you, I, I always get like absorbed in them. And then there's no more demo left, and I can't play it, and I get sad. Which is kind of what happened with Odd Sparks. But yeah, I've I've had a, a few people recommend Star Trek to me. I'm like one person who said it, it it's loud. It is a loud game. I think I may already have um to check on Keymailer, but I think I'm already like have, have my hand out or ah oh I'm hungry Dogs. <laughs> then I will <laughs> thank you for sharing that with me I like that that's fun oh it's like all bent and shit Oh. And even smaller blocks. I have like mystery rock substance and I or I don't know. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna put that there. That's perfect. <laughs> Bye, Ollie! Bye, Dirty Toss! What is that? Is that rot? Cool, I can make my house look like a uh, junkyard. Cool. I just. It's fine. This is just my trash pile. I just think of me as like Fraggle in the, in the trash pile on Fraggle Rock. Or like Mogra in the labyrinth with all the, the, the stuff. Uh, Alright, oh, what is that? Root, that's fire clay.
Okay, so I've got a bunch of storage boxes. And so that and then like that mix. Yeah, there we go. sleeps thank you need to have this uh All right, there we go. I'm building a road.
It's like, why does this look so weird? Okay, that's because the the dirt is exposed still on the map. Uh... I guess we can go around this pit here. Just fiends it, I reckon. So I'm building a road from uh, a little building that I've got here up to this space here so that I can start moving stuff to my new house. Or where I want to build my new house. Um, and that's because if I don't if I don't put a road in, it's gonna be a pain in the ass, and I'm gonna get lost. That's what happens. <laughs> um, and then. The road helps stop you from getting lost, but it also helps um, with speed. You get a, a little multiplier when you run on a road. So when I'm getting to a point where I'm moving lots of materials, it is pretty fucking big. Um, I I am about as south as you can get. Like the flight a flight line is like the edge of the world. Um That is the spawn, so this is kind of in the middle, the, the zero point, and then it's the same amount of distance up, but I haven't gone up. Um, so I think there's... Your points will lie? Thank you, Prickly. I will do a hydrating stretch anyway. Oh. I am curious what's up north. There you go. Dirty Toes has got you. Sounds bad. But yeah, you move quite a bit faster on a road. Oh, thank you. I kind of wish I'd gone north now, knowing how the, the temperature zones work. So unlike uh, Earth, um. I'm just going to keep going at this angle. Um, temperature zones work like, uh, they're just like stripes. So you get like po polar temperate, equatorial temperate polar, so on and so forth.
if there's a repeat it depends on how hello this is emilio hello. aka echo in mexico with a friendly reminder please take some time for yourself do I, a stretch I take did. your vitamins or medication have a siesta fiesta take a walk and don't forget be kind to yourself I did a stretch and a hydrate and I ate my dinner. The, the thrusting arm animation when you're too far away from something is really fucking creepy and alarming. I'm pretty excited that I have a I, I've got a bit of a road going now. Feeling pretty fancy. Entirely sure what the path was that I originally planned, but oh god, the the shovel is doing. stuff <gasps> yes you love an ice cream sandwich oh like a neapolitan one oh you fancy That's usually what flavor ice cream we get because we're also like apparently I'm picky but I just like having different flavors having the same flavor all the time oh yeah the paper on those things is fucking annoying because they just kind of stick to everything I don't know what that is but it sounds fancy this music is so fucking stressful it's ridiculous yeah it's like neapolitan but with extra bits oh
Uh oh. What'd you ruin perfectly good ice cream for by putting cherry in it? Oh, I don't like how this is. I'm glad that you enjoy cherry flavor. It is most decidedly not a me flavor. But I am glad other people enjoy it. This. Uh, why is this so weird? That bit feels weird and uncomfortable, and I don't like it. Thanks, Eric. Uh, Sadie. Love it. Hey, I'm almost on track to where I was before anyway. That was a Freudian slip there. I think it's fine. It just looks weird. Churro ice cream? Now that sounds like something I could get into. the hot honey and cinnamon made oh yeah toast had uh hot honey and cinnamon ice cream my least favorite ice cream anything with cherries <laughs> This is like spicy honey. Salt and straws flavor of the month. Toast is not does not toast does not like chocolate. Bubble gum? That's fair. Tastes weird as an ice cream. It is a bit of a, a weird flavor profile. I can understand that. The least favorite is going to be pink peppermint with actual mint or bubble. Oh god. Chocolate champarado with sesame toffee. The fuck is that? I 
I don't even know what that is. Oh, all right. Aqua? I think this is... I think one of my favorite, I don't know, at least favorite, but I think one of my favorite combinations is like raspberry and chocolate. But with like raspberry and then like chocolate swirls. I just, I'm a sucker for that, that the tart and the sweet. Yeah. I like sweet tart things. That's why I like Sadie. Because Sadie's a sweet tart. You're a sour, you are. Absolutely. Where is this turning? Going this way? Here. Oh yeah, the genies have some pretty good wins. For sure. Yeah, the pineapple upside down cake one, I was pleasantly surprised by. I think out of the Genie's ones, I think the one I liked the most was the gooey butter cake. Yeah, I think so, because I I remember telling you about the banana pudding one. Is me saying that your wife wasn't really into banana pudding ones, but actually did like that one. Flam, Flam is like on the tree. Good job of it. Did 
to come back and get stone. Maybe ice cream. Do it. Oh, yeah, no, do that first. Um, well, I'm running low on road pieces. <laughs> Honestly, that I'm I'm intrigued by uh, the the making of obsidian because then I don't need to farm rocks. <laughs> Yeah, no, I'm, I'm all out of lava. I missed the lava, lava. Mm -hmm. That's all right. I mean, it's not like it's it's not that difficult to go bouldering. I've really got that much to go. Oh god, this music. Well, now you've all got me thinking about ice cream. So thanks for that. Music intensifying. Thing now originally I was like gonna come and follow this up and over. <laughs> I I was not chastising you, thank you. Absolutely not. But you did just remind me that I need to have some more almond butter on crackers. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, do I do you want me to skip this track quickly? You don't hear it. That's pretty quiet. I think. Apparently we've got cyberpunk vibes going on now. Guess we've got to have it elevated now, huh? Whoops. I'm all out of food. I've got no ice cream. Wee. Oh, 
Well, this helps. Totally toot. It's a good thing you can cook when you're hungry. I may have to make some more peanut butter soon. Six degrees Celsius and raining. It still won't take. Oh, grass on six places. That's a technical term. really enjoying these ferns the, the ferns that Rex really doesn't like why can I not I've added a lot of color to this place. I like that.
I can stop eating this whenever I want. Really? Yeah, I'm looking at an eye. What about it? Hmm. Get chained, let it go to waste. Okay. Ooh, the coffee tastes different now. All right, let's make some more glass. I think I have some more of that quartz shit. Twenty-four, right? go through here. Let's see what else I have that can be smelted. Oh, sorry, not smelted, but mm -hmm. yes, yeah, smelted. Bloomerid. Bloomerid. minutes of normal rift activity ripe in about 26.8 days
firing for another two days. Hey! <gasps> My pomegranates are rooted! 50 days from the 8th of March. All right. So. I did, oh. No, the only thing I haven't done is that. Um, so I got road, dirt. Oh, my little tea set. Um, well, it's 10.30. So how about I make some more peanut butter? Current syrup is sunflower oil. I'm going to use it. Olive oil for the peanut butter because you can't use it like so, but I'm going to grind it into paste. But to have a mill. Must make ridiculous amounts of peanut butter. <laughs>
Reading your first floor? Ooh, what are you upgrading it to? Brickley, I just saw the picture you posted of, uh... <laughs> He's such a goof. What is he doing? With his feet up like that. Jonesy, what a dog. Maybe he's like, I have seen human with feet up. I will also do a feet up. <laughs> it was very orange. Eakin cats, man. Should have done a dare for dare drop to make peanut butter, like 20 liters of peanut butter or something. As if that would require mods. I would like my arm to stop looking fucked up now, please. This is, this is how we get through the night here. We kill time in the evening by making peanut butter. Ads coming up shortly ish. About a minute and a half. You're forgetting that when uh, the, the peanut paste, like making a shitload of peanut paste, means there's going to be a lot of peanut butter. Because it dilutes.
and a half liters. You know, I feel like I feel like that's enough. Fucking buckets. Stop holding the bucket like that. Yeah, it's it's not that it's bugged out. <clears throat> I don't know. I think from using a shovel. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, it has been fine up until I started doing a bunch of digging, and then it it went weird. Um, but yeah, I already altered it just so my arm, I didn't have weird, creepy bug arms. But for some reason, my right, <clears throat> my right arm is dislocated from my body in this perspective. So it's just like floating in front of me. Which is super comfy. <clears throat> Man, my throat. What is this with red current? Hmm. The allergies have been pretty rough here lately, so I think that's part of it. A bit congested.
<coughs> oh, the sun's come up. We've spent all night in the kitchen making peanut butter. Some people are up all night to get lucky. We're up all night to make peanut butter. Or something. <coughs> Honestly. The. Uh, <laughs> the. Nut. Nut. The other night when we made that almond butter, Flint and I were both like, we were super tired and wanted something to eat. And he's like, you still haven't made, tried making almond butter yet. And I was like, huh. <sighs> Should we try it? He's like, yeah, all right. <laughs> it was like three o'clock in the morning. We are like, wait, do we need to add oil? Should I add salt? Do we need honey in this? All right, we have just shy of 13 liters. Oh, here we go. <clears throat> no. I th I think I'm pick pick picking up what you're putting down. But you're not wrong. Peanut butter. No, look, this is just a stupid amount to leave, have left over. I'm just gonna drink it. Mmm, peanut paste. Delicious. Oh, 
Well, it didn't do too badly, considering I wasn't sure if I'd have the, uh, the get up and go to stream today. Okay, I have food. Um, I I gotta go get more rocks, man. I need more rock. <gasps> My olives are fruiting. More pomegranate fruiting. I'm so excited. Where do I want to go? A bouldering. Actually, you know what? If I head over to these ruins. The last round of ruins that I went through, I got quite a lot of rock. Well, quite a lot of stones. I planted so many trees around here. I kind of love it. So those ones were all wood, but to the south, the other south, yeah, southeast, no, southwest, there were some stone ones. Another big bloody hole. Something amazing is about to happen, but I don't know what. Well, a, a rift spawned nearby. That's pretty exciting. Can you? Hey, you can. All right. Interesting. We can break down cobblestone back into blocks.
Oh my god, this music is so intense. Right? Shit is going down. It really does sound like Final Fantasy music. It's like some big, like, primal fight. Hi, Sadie. Oh my god, even the fanfare at the end. The fuck? I love it. I think I have it in this channel actually. Do I? Ah. Oh. I should probably add that. Oh no, there it is. I think it's just called like coffee can or something. <gasps> oh, I found loot. Ooh. Well, it's not called cock. full of nuts. Okay, I genuinely wasn't expecting to find anything down here. I was just digging because... I was going to break all these down. I hadn't uh, considered like I knew you could excavate the ruins but I didn't realize like
um I can't finish my sentences. Okay. Good, good job, your room. Hmm. Honestly, I almost feel like this is a a better way of getting a stone. And going hunting for boulders. I mean, it leaves big gaping holes on the ground, but... That'll grow over. Now what is this? Honestly, this is kind of entertaining me.
It's uh, scratching the same itch as when I play No Man's Sky and I have to like excavate the entire material out of each like mining node, copper node, whatever. Okay, shoot. In care. Ah, uh, yes, the good old second guess. You jerk. Freaking pack your hyenas fell in my in the hole I was excavating. Oh, there you go. Good idea. Alright, I'm just gonna put like a, a little dot here. Because my inventory be full. We're gonna come back. Yeah, because I feel like it's it's caring for your skin after wearing the cosmetic.
So the only things that I've got lately have been these, which are like clear ones to go over my lipstick because almost all of my uh, Ramel lipsticks, it's masking tape on it so I could mask my, mark my favorite one. Here's a, a clear at the end and they've almost all like run out. So I've been trying a couple of different clear coats um, to see if any of them work without like taking the color off over time. I on these uh, Romel colors, I I love them. I think Sadie ended up buying a couple because of me, because <laughs> of the way I was waffling on about them. This one's. I think my favorite is called Kiss Kiss Fatal. Doesn't really. Um, I order them on Amazon when they're on, they go on sale occasionally for like $3 something a pop and I've got like a bunch of different colors. But I really like them because they do last, most of them last all stream. And they don't dry my lips out so I just go to bed and then I wake up and sometimes it still looks like I've got lipstick on in the morning when I get up. I look fabulous. But if you want them to want it to come off, you can just put like lip balm and then wipe it off. So you don't need to use a makeup remover. So the um those makeup removing the you know the like little pink makeup remover cloth that you can get. little fuzzy thing works a treat oh that's a bugger This is this is the way here. Yeah, like I, I said for mine I use like I don't know, I've got like an EOS lip balm that I keep by the bed and if I really want to get the uh lipstick off, I just swipe it at and wipe it off with a bit of loo paper. But otherwise it stays on. That's pretty amazing. Oh my god, this is amazing! I'm getting these like road pieces out of this. Oh, 
I've got another sconce and a little blue brick. Got a doormat. Yeah, it's, I don't know, it's funny. I, I never used to particularly care. I mean, I still don't really, but I, I enjoy, like, I think I've only really been wearing lipstick after a year, about a year. I think, or maybe not long before Sadie visited last year. I can't remember when that was. Yeah. My earbuds are yelling at me about a low battery, but that's okay because the server's about to go down. Means it's probably about time for me to think about wrapping up. Um, I do plan on streaming tomorrow. I know I haven't done, it feels like I haven't done a craft stream all year and I feel kind of bad about it. It's been interesting hearing your progress about it over with it prickly. Like the the figuring out how it works and then, you know, like the well not interesting for the when you like lost all your data, but it's been interesting to to watch from an outside point of view. Cause it's a hundred percent the sort of thing that I would do if I had a lot of different bits and pieces. Yeah, well, you know, having it not 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 delete would be a good. It's a, probably a good start. But yeah, my all I've got in my all I use are the lipsticks and these clear clay coats. All right, let's have a looky. Okay, I think I'm gonna wrap up. I'm gonna send you over to Ravi. It is part of it, and that's probably a useful data point as well for you. Um, I'm gonna send you over to Ravi. She's playing New World. Uh, you know Ravi. You all know Ravi. She's a good bean. Thank you. Thanks for hanging out with me, Prickly. I always enjoy it. Yes. I'll do a big stand up and a stretch. Here is my raids and my socials. Um, I do... I feel okay. So I feel like I probably will be on tomorrow for a craft stream. I'm just going to keep pretty chill. It's always a craft stream today. Um, so yeah. Oh my god, my earbuds. Very battery. Uh, so yeah, you guys all have a good evening. Take care, be safe, be well, be kind, and all that stuff. And I will catch you tomorrow at around 4pm Eastern. Bye!